Now the Saints, they dropped four straight home games. Yep. I mean, they're still in this thing if they just beat Atlanta. And opening kickoff, they got some emotion. It's Jalen Saunders, not to be confused with Deion Sanders. You got their record. I'd have been asked them right now. <laughs> and look at the rookie out of Oklahoma. His first kickoff return ever <laughs> is 99 so. yards. He's down <laughs> at the one. Hamstrings on fire. Come on, man. Proud look at him. Look at him. <laughs> he can't even get up. Well, he's Mark, done. He's done for at least a quarter. Mark Ingram would take it in from there. It's seven six now in the second. Drew Brees pressured and throws it the wrong way. Brees having a rough year, man. Saints would recover, but it would take him out of field goal range. I have no idea what Drew was doing, but it didn't work. Now, as far as Julio Jones, he missed last week's game with a bad hip. Mm -hmm. Before the game, he's hipping, he's hopping, he's hipping, he's hopping, and he's good to go. And boy, was he good. Matt Ryan. That's a gain of 24 inside the five. You can see we're running out of time. First and goal, Ryan. A good call down here. Eric Weems. Yeah, their running game is not effective. Capped off a 15-play, 89-yard drive, and the Falcons taking Mighty Mo into the locker room up 13-7. Third quarter, Ryan to Jones. It's a grown man, man. He had his third straight 100-yard game. Six plays later, the rookie, Devontae Freeman. His first NFL rushing touchdown. Look at the burst. What college he went to? He went to Florida State. That's what I thought. Yes, he did. So the, my roll. He watching, baby. Falcons are up 20-7. Put 20 that thing to seven. down. <laughs> now, Jimmy Graham, he has just eight catches in his last three games. He and Breeze not on the same page. No, this hurts. one's a little high, and he's got the bad shoulder. That was a business decision right there. All That's right. what that was. So you tell me what this one was. If that was a business decision, what this is this? This is a business business decision. Hey, 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 hey. Come on, he got his cash. Yeah, but you want to get hit. You want to be able to enjoy your money. Okay. Well, this is the biggest play of the game. With his team down 13 in the fourth, Breeze hits Graham, who tries to get into the end zone, but it's Kamal Ishmael. Call me Ishmael. Ripping it away and picking it up. Now, remember, every turnover is reviewed, so they give it a look. Did he cross the goal line? You can't quite tell. That's a great play. You can't play. debate forward progress, so call the field stands. It's a fumble. Jimmy, none too pleased. Sean, yeah, I get you. Now, the Saints would get back in this thing thanks to the combo of Breeze and Graham. That's almost impossible to stop. That backs your faith. Six for 53 yards in the touch, and they're down just six. So the Falcons thinking, okay, let's get a few first downs. Well, here on third and eight, Ryan throws short to Roddy Roddy White. Good tackle by Kenny Vaccaro, who was demoted recently. And so the Saints are in business until Drew Brees on second and 10, looking for my Nick Toon friends, picked off by Robert McLean. Mr. McLean, the Saints lost five straight home games. Their playoff aspirations are finished. In the meantime, the Falcons, six and nine, but they will be playing Carolina for NFC South supremacy.